Hey, I think it's working. Some toes. Hey guys. So. <laughs> oh no. Let's. I feel like I don't know. I'm too tall. Oh, there we go. Yeah, but then I'm too short. No. Okay, that works. Oh no. <laughs> hey guys. So if you watched our cheddar cheese, our Canadian cheese soup video, we talked about making Hungarian mushroom soup. And that's what we're going to do today because it's a nasty rainy day. And again, again, so we just want some soup. So we've got everything ready and the ingredients are four tablespoons of unsalted butter, um, two cups of chopped onions. I've got just a little over a cup cut up. I, I like them really, really small. So, um, then a pound of mushrooms sliced. We used our pampered chef slicer thing, which is amazing. Um, two teaspoons of dill, a tablespoon of paprika, a tablespoon of soy sauce, two cups of chicken broth, a cup of milk, some salt, some pepper, just to taste, um, two teaspoons of lemon juice, oh, fresh parsley, which He'll have I'll to go out and get out of the, yeah. yeah, we've got parsley out in our <clears throat> garden, so he can just go run and grab that, but that's for the very end anyway. And then um, half cup sour cream, which we don't have sour cream, but we have Greek yogurt, which yep. is just, just a great substitute. It's just as good. So let's get started. Oh, get parsley. Okay. Right. Um, it says half a cup. So, so I'm just going to melt this butter and get the onions going. So while I'm gonna put the onions over here while the butter melts, I'll be ready to throw that in. I'm gonna use my handy dandy spoon thing, with a spoon. Fresh cut. Fresh cut parsley. We raise a lot of this. We do raise a lot of it. It's actually kind of become a weedy. So that's all right though. So it says to melt the butter and then saute the onions for five minutes. So just, you know, until they're translucent or whatever. And then we'll add the mushrooms and saute them for five minutes. to the peeps. Say hello. I'm here to sample, but I don't like mushrooms. <laughs> you don't eat these things. No, you don't. Pampered Chef item that she's talking about. I'll show you right there. So we actually really like it because I usually do it this way. But <laughs> you can fill up the uh, container with this fresh parsley that's sticking to my fingers out of the garden. Parsley garden, I guess. And how fine would you like it? Oh, it just. Oh, it actually it goes is. in the soup. So. so it'll break up or uh, flavor it anyway. Yeah, we just don't want to get a big leaf of parsley when we're eating.
And that's it. Great little tool. We use it to cut the mushrooms, the onions. Good Lord, we cut all sorts of stuff with it. Even fingers, if you're not careful. So it doesn't actually say what kind of onion to use. I had bought purple onions for the Canadian cheese soup. Um, and the only thing that our Walmart had was a bag of four red onions. So, um, so that's what we're using is red onion for this. These are getting nice and sauteed. And we cut them so small, they get kind of mushy. Okay. Putting in one pound of mushrooms. We'll let them saute for about five minutes ish. I just, I kind of let them saute until I like the way they look. So, but I get all the onion and everything. In. Again, this is where we need smell o vision. Yeah. Smell o is great. Smell o is great, huh? Yeah. I'm liking how this looks. Let me show you. So what I'm gonna do is I'm ready to add the dill and the paprika, which I've just put in this little prep bowl thing. And then I added the soy to the chicken broth, so we'll just add that. Clean, Chef. Yes, yes thank chef. you. Let's get Neville Worker B in the kitchen with you. What? I said it's good to have a worker bee in the kitchen. Yeah, yeah. Buzz, buzz, buzz. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. We'll turn it down to low now and let it simmer for 15 minutes, covered. 15 minutes later. <laughs> And we'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, so the timer just went off for the 15 minutes. And it's just simmering away. The next thing I need to do is with the uh, three tablespoons of flour and salt. I need to whisk it with the milk and then we'll add it to the to the soup mixture and then it will simmer again for another 15 minutes very much like the Canadian cheese soup recipe actually another 15 minutes. Okay, the timer has gone off. And now we're going to add the rest of the ingredients. Oh, I need some nipple toys. So we're putting in Lemon juice, I'll sprinkle 
in some black pepper. Parsley. Sour cream or an arcade yogurt. At this point, you're just letting it warm up a bit. And it'll be ready to eat. Taste it? Sure. Mm -hmm. Good. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Yep. It's really hot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Torch the top of your mouth yet? Mm -mm. Okay. Mushrooms hold heat really well. You like mushroom soup? If you like mushrooms, you should have this soup. Yeah. So. Mini hootie. Well, I think we're done. Hope you like the recipe. Yeah, let us know if you like it. Like and subscribe and comment. We like comments. Comment. So, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.